Hello and welcome to another video and today we have something quite fantastic in the news following on from the C64 Mini and also the C64 both of which are checked out uh, there's also the VIC-20 which I haven't had the pleasure of we now have the Amiga A500 Mini now full disclosure I had a ZX Spectrum back in the day and then an Atari ST so <laughs> rivals what I've just referenced but I can enjoy all the meats of our cultural stew so yeah don't shout at me uh, I will just say at this point, if you can hear a bit of a rattling in the background, my old PC has decided to have an off day with one of its fans. I said last time I made a vlog, I was in I was mid sentence, and an ice cream van came past. You know, what the odds? What the odds? So maybe I'll also put a fan on while it's getting warm, so I have to shout over the top, eh? So I'll just run the trailer that's come out today, because uh, the alternative is that you look at my face. So uh, I'll just go through uh, the press release that's come out today. So it just says the A500 Mini, now other classic consoles are just toys. It includes 25 Amiga classics, including Worms, the Chaos Engine, Another World, which is one of my all-time favourites, even though I'm not very good at it, and Simon the Sorcerer, and they all feature on the A500 Mini. Continuing the popular lineup of timeless classic consoles being given a new lease of life, today Retro Games announces the creation of this console, a fully licensed reimagining of the much loved 16 bit home computer, starring a plethora of classic Amiga games. I, mean, I, do, I will say, yes, I had the Atari ST, but I could certainly appreciate what the Amiga had to offer. In fact, uh, one of my friends at uni had, because uh, that was from like 1990, had. Um, um, one of my friends had a, an Amiga, so yeah, I got to play on that for a bit. We're usually playing Sensible World of Soccer. That was always fun. Anyway, it continues. Due early 2022, the Amiga 500 Mini is a homage, homage, homage to the 80s heyday of 16-bit personal computing, inspired by the 87 release of the Amiga 500, which featured a 16-32-bit CPU, 512K of RAM, and an array of custom chips for producing best-in-class sound and video. Play one of the included 25 classic Amiga games, selected from a simple-to-use carousel, including all-time greats in Otherworld, Simon the Sorcerer, The Chaos Engine and Worms, or sideload your own games by USB stick and full WHD load support and an array of options to choose from. Plus, save and resume your game at any time to help you finish those punishingly difficult classics. Well, I could certainly use that for another world, I tell you. Developed by Retro Games Limited and distributed by Koch Media, the A500 Mini features the perfect emulation of not only the original A500 OCS, an enhanced chipset ECS of future revisions, but also the advanced graphics architecture AGA of the A1200. The the the, so the, the A500 Mini comes with original style two-button mouse and also a newly engineered eight-button precision gamepad allowing you to choose your control method. To complement the on-screen keyboard, you can also plug in an external standard PC keyboard for additional functionality, so that will be a, a real help. Paul Andrews, Managing Director of Retro Games, says, In this initial mini version of the A500, we have created what we believe gaming fans will love, and will see as the evolution of minigames consoles. And Debbie Beswick, MBE, CEO at Team17, says, Retro Games have developed a truly unique product. I'm very excited to have our classic games represented in all their original glory. And the A500 Mini will hit the shops in early 2022, so there's not a precise date set as of yet, but the suggested retail price, and it's a, a penny off these, so I'll round them up, uh, £120 in the UK, €130, Euros, $140 American dollars, and $200 Australian dollars. So obviously take uh, one cent or one penny off each of those. Now the announced game list so far is, there's only announced 12 of the 25 titles, uh, the rest are still to be announced at a later date. We've got Alien Breed 3D, Another World, ATR All-Terrain Racing, Battle Chess, Cadaver, Kickoff 2, Pinball Dreams, Simon the Sorcerer, Speedball 2, Brutal Deluxe, which is a fantastic game, The Chaos Engine, Worms, The Director's Cut, Zool, Ninja of the Ent Dimension, and that's so far what we've got. And also says included in the box is uh, a wired USB classic mouse. So that's a, with a 1.8 meter 6 foot cable. And the same cable for a, a precision 8 button gamepad. A USA to USB C power cable. Because there's no power supply, so you power it by USB. And an HDMI cable, which is uh, 6 foot long again, to hook it up 
to, uh, to allowing full compat compatibility, get me words out with all modern TVs. Other features include a save game function, selectable 50Hz or 60Hz screen refresh, CRT filter and multiple scaling options. And also you can upload your own files, games and firmware revisions via the USB flash drive, which you'll have to provide yourself, but they're, they're quite cheap. You only pay a few quid for those. So yeah, got something uh, really nice here. And as I say, it's not uh, a, a, a computer, because not a console I've played with before, but uh, certainly a computer I've not played with before. But um, I'm really looking forward to this. I think it looks fantastic. Let's see. I'd love to see just how Mini is Mini. I mean, obviously, if it's the same size as the C64 Mini, which I can see in my eye shot. Um, yeah, we'll need a keyboard adding to that if we want to type on it because it's not a, an actual physical keyboard. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to this. I think it's fantastic. So and I, we figured the um, the Amiga was coming at some point. So uh, yeah, obviously following the C64 and the VIC-20. So uh, I'm glad it's certainly coming out. So yeah, can't wait to check this out. Uh, once we get news of any you know, the other games that have uh, announced for this system uh, we'll bring that to you but for the meantime that's all we have so please uh, let me know all your thoughts in the comments below in the meantime please please like this video share it with your friends and subscribe if you haven't already click on the bell for all the notifications and thank you genesis